Live in Eastern, everybody. Harrison Wild alongside my partner, Scott Vandersloot, as the Bulldogs set to take on the Michigan Tech Huskies here in Big Rapids, Michigan tonight. The Bulldogs will attack right to left across your radio dial to open tonight's hockey game. Center for Rechtenwald. Rechtenwald trying to chip it along further, but it's stolen away by the Huskies. Top of the zone, Finner got it. Rechtenwald's in, shoots and scores! And the Rocket puts it in. The Bulldogs lead it one to nothing on a turnover at the top of the Husky zone. Rechtenwald. And it's 1-0 Bulldogs. Just like last week against Bemidji State, a broken play for the first goal. And Lucas Finner got the goal last week. He breaks up the play this week and gets it off to Trevor Rechtenwald, who scored the goal. And what a start for Ferris State. Not even two minutes into it, already up a goal on the Huskies. Jackson lets one in, and it's the first shot he faced. Huskies had it down deep in the Bulldog end for a while. But now, it's the Bulldogs making it 1-0. Rechtenwald dumps it in the backhand down the left wing wall. McDougal on the four check, stole it. Loose in front of the goal, Clark has a chance. Clark from the far point, Clark shoots it, stop Munson. Rebound loose in front of the goal, Tackett shoots it and stopped by Munson. Another shot, McDougal is blocked in front up in the air and cleared away by the Husky. Big hit in the corner by Drew Mayer. Just runs right through a man. And then lost it there. Nice play in the four check by the Huskies. Mack and turned it right over, right by the shot. Kick stop, rebound loose in the slot, and they score. Far side, gonna be great sitting right Meyer to tie it up. Got it to the far side now. Mayer centering pass off the side of the goal. Goes out to the far side. And there's Gavin Gould. Lost it there. Here's Mayer on a breakaway. Mayer is in. Stopped by Munson. Ferrance goes wide of the goal as he kind of fanned on it. He was wide open. Lucini down there to Gould. Gould has no lane in front. Shot stopped by Smith. Rebound clear to the top of the zone, but not out. Donahue the shot. Blocked in front. Rebound stopped by Smith again. He hangs out for the draw. 1-1 the score between Fair State and Michigan Tech. There's a clearing attempt, skipped in on goal stop by Smith as he's run through there after the whistle. The right wing side with speed. Over the blue line, Killens is in, stops, looking for help. Spins back up top to Norris. Norris for Joe Rutkowski, touch feet. Killens winds, fires, scores! Oh my goodness, what a rip for Riker! Power play goal, five on three, and they get two one dogs. 15-18 to go in the second period. Riker Killens initially brought that one to the zone with a lot of speed, kicked it back to Cole Norris, ended up getting the puck back, and we've seen him take shots like that before, and that was a cannon from Riker Killens right at the top of the zone. He hesitated for a moment, took his spot, got it past the man and past the goaltender, Packy Munson. To keep the Bulldogs on the man advantage, now leading 2-1. Here's a breakaway for Norris. Down the left wing, Norris shoots and scores! Oh, we got back-to-back -back power play goals! And Ferris State leads it 3-1 in the second! Pandemonium in Hayward Haven Ice Arena. Back-to-back -back goals, about four seconds in between those. And that's just how you drop the power play. Not one, but two goals here for Ferris State. And you couldn't have executed that perfectly if you wish for it. Unbelievable. And it's going to be a timeout for Michigan Tech. And Packy Munson's headed to the bench. Not sure if that's going to be the end of his night. But with 15.04 to go here in the second period, it's 3-1 Ferris State. Back-to-back -back power play goals. A very short interval apart. And they will call on Devin Carroll to relieve Packy Munson. Hello, looking for Reitmeyer. Smith out there. Playing it up the far wall. Turn it over. Les Perrantz has it into the middle. Gould with a lot of room. Shoots and scores. Gavin Gould on the power play as the Huskies capitalize on the five-minute major and the Bulldogs just lost track of a guy in front of the Clark who's just out of the box. Lost it up top, Mark Off. Far side there for Burks. Down low, Stamen's got it. Stamen back to Dane Burks. Into the middle for Mark Off. Fakes the shot. Down low, Stamen. Touch pass, shot, they score! Tommy Beretta guns it home and it's 3-3. Back up the near wall. Maloney had it. Far side, Killens got a lot of room. Killens is in, walks to the top of the zone, didn't find a lane. Now Killens is looking at one. Finner, back to Killens. Near side for Callen. Back to Killens, one timer, Rocket scores! Might have been tipped in front, Riker Killens puts it home. And the Bulldogs lead 4-3, a power play goal again. As they regain what was once a two goal lead. And it's gonna be Killens' his second of the game. Eighth of the year. We've seen Riker Killens all season be the quarterback of this power play, and he's done it time and time again, already once today, and once more tonight as Callen plays it back to Killens, who 
saw the up. Popped up in the air. McDougal had it, and it's in his feet. Lesperance jumps around him, and here's Lesperance on a break. Lesperance fakes the shot into the middle. Lucini stopped by Smith. And the pass kind of disconnected. It got to Lucini, and Darren Smith put both knees down on it. Here's side McDougal. McDougal carries up the left wing. Forward to Rechtenwald over the blue line into the middle. Here's Finner. Finner is in. Shoot. Stopped by Munson. Up by the Bulldogs. are probably fortunate that I think Marshall Moyes got the stick on that one. And a shot one timer into the glove of Smith and out. Who has it? Going to stick it off of Burks. Burks spun it back into the zone to Reitmeyer. Reitmeyer, long shot blocked off the backside of Hetch. Another shot, Stamen, and stopped by Smith. Rebound, they're hammering away on the doorstep, and Smith hangs on for the draw. 15 seconds on the clock. Beretta's behind the goal. Centering pass out front to the far side. Jackson poked to the top of the zone, kept in by Burks. Burks through traffic, onto the tape of a Bulldog. Cleared into the corner. Giordurantes ties it up. One second on the clock. Ferris State going to win it. By the skin of their teeth, it went all the way down to the end, and Ferris State finds a way.